What the hell do you want? Senior Airman Motri, tell me some. How has your trip to Florida been so far? It has been great. I have no complaints. It's hot. It's big ass lizards, big ass roosters everywhere. Mm -hmm. I'm tired of the bugs. I'm ready to go home. Mm. That's about it. But other than that, it's been great. You've been stressing me out, but that has been fine. What's the best part about Florida so far? Say hey, Sergeant Nunes. Wave. What's the best place you've been to so far out here? What since we've been here? Mm -hmm. No clubs, no Probably places to eat. I don't, I don't like the clubs down here. Probably Key West Beach because I like the water. Key West Beach. Mm -hmm. The beach we went to. Florida. What? It was the state park we went to. They went to the state park. You remember the name of it? No. Sorry, Sergeant Huffman. What has been your favorite part about Florida so far? I don't have a favorite part. You didn't like the. You didn't like any of the clubs out here. No. What? What about the scenery? Boring. You just ready to go home? Yes. That's a hard question, you know. I will say the females. I will say the females. The females. What about them? About them. Very beautiful females out here. I'm going to come back to Durham complaining. Have you had a favorite place to eat? The barbecue place. The, the barbecue place was pretty good. You got anything else to say about Florida, bro? Y'all should come visit Florida. That's all I have to say. It's a good experience out here. That's pretty chill, man. There's a lot to do, man. So much that you can go down. You can go to the beach, go to the club, go eat out, bro. There's so much to do, man. Your first service is TDY, bro. Yeah, for real. What, you, what you got to say about it? You ready to go on another one? Most definitely. Tell them we've been working hard there, LaCruz. Slaving. Slaving, bro. This is what happens when you work hard. Ah, right, let's start this check. We at Homestead Air Force Base uh, doing a little check on the gym. As y'all can see, nobody's in here. We got Senior Airman Motri behind the camera. We're doing a little wall check in here. Y'all know LeBron James played on this court. They had a, the, uh, when he was on the Miami Heat, they had a practice in here. We got De La Cruz and McCormick over there. They lit. This is the gym. Um, we basically just make sure everything's wiped down, make sure they got the weights put up. My boy Dan, and he lit. Usually, most problems we have, people not putting weight up. But right now, it's early in the morning. And the good thing about these windows, they're insulated. So no matter, if you, no matter when you touch it, no matter how hot it gets in Florida, it's always going to be the same degrees. The 24-hour access door in the back. It's leg day for my peoples in here. We got it. One, two, three, four, five. Y'all say hello to Motri, yo. This right here, baby. Right. Yes, sir. Tell him. 82nd so, Airborne Division. Baby. Best of the best right I'm sorry, there. Sorry, man. That's what we do. That's right. Thank you for what you do, man. Yes, sir. Thank you for what you do. We don't know about that Army part, but the 82nd Airborne, we love y'all, too. Family business. They just built a, um, a simulated golf course in there. This is the family room. Yeah, we ain't, we ain't trying to get nobody kids up. This right here, this is where De La Cruz gets all his work done at. Shake, 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 shake. You know, got to get his squats on. He's a cardio guy. <laughs> We're at where everybody get on these bikes and they go fast and fast and fast and do nothing. And I don't know why, because these hurt your, your butt, so you don't want to sit on there anyways. I, don't, I think that's not the short show. Here we have everybody working out, exercising. They look like they're having fun. Yeah. And I, oh! So let me tell you about something. Okay, last week, a treadmill caught fire or whatever. So they have a, like a little emergency. Had to evacuate. I'm being nosy. I ain't know what they're over there to talk about. Go get them a corner. Anyway, so yeah. Sorry, I'm too nosy. The women's locker room, another locker room over here. They got the men's. Um, I did not. Be a nosy. If it was a problem, your, your supervisor would have said something to you. So we did like a whole run around around the gym, uh, the fitness center. We're back at the front. I have a quick question. 
What's PCA? That's the parent and child. Oh. Um, so typically, like I said, we'll come by every day, including the field. We always try to make sure that we are picking up any paper, any debris, any trash that we may see. And then we always try to make sure these trash cans are empty. So we're going to walk out mm -hmm. here. You're going to also see that with this parking lot, sometimes it's filled with debris. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it's not. But we try to encourage our patrons to use those trash cans. So we try to make them available to our patrons. So I always just make sure that every day that we're just walking through this parking lot. And again, I said, this is something very, very simple, but it's significant because the look and feel of the environment you want it to be so far. So this is just one of our hourly checks. Do y'all try over to the tennis um, court too? Is yes. that y'all? Huh? Yeah, do y'all have a pool on base? No. No? Used to. Oh, I okay. think they said a while back, but now they don't have it. So they come like once or twice a week. They cut the grass. They'll pick up any sticks or whatever debris you may have, like a bigger bowl. Okay, this mm -hmm. is a big one, and then a small one in the pool. So this whole thing surrounds this whole softball field. And so how far? How long is this, like distance-wise? So it's it's pretty much the same thing as that one over there, but you got to take the whole perimeter all oh, the way around. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And it's the same mileage. Oh, believe okay. It, believe it or not. Yeah, it's, it's probably it's like pro probably point one. Uh, oh, mile. okay. That's it. Oh. We did this. Thursday, but you can already tell a difference. Like you can see weeds over here growing, just slowly start. And our dirt is just so tough at times. So softball mm -hmm. fields have a, a shed part over the what is it? The dugout, the dugout. Mm -hmm. Like the chairs are, and it's hotter down here. Yep. So like, if people want to come out and play or whatever, they probably don't want to come as often because it's no shed or anything like a closed-in dugout. It's just the bleachers. Mm 